going to be Lindsay Dorado and Grand Metalik. And in the other corner, they will be dealing with Randy Orton and Riddle. Only the right to be called a champion would bring a competitor to the most intimidating structure in all of WWE. I've heard those pods you waited might as well be called emotional encapsulation pods because if you are fearful, you become more fearful. If you are enraged, you become more enraged. Then your pod opens and you either burst out or cower away. He's staring his opponent down, getting into that zone. Four. Oh, gets put into the barricade. Adrenaline is pumping, and the this game's about winning at any and all costs. This competitor knows exactly what they want to do. Perched on the top rope, here it is! Superplex! <laughs> the challenger's looking shaken. Combination. That's how you hurt your opponent. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Taking flight. Splash. Oh. Uh -huh. 
turn around on Metalik. Big hip toss into the cartwheel. And a knee struck. What a combination. Riddle up high. From the top. Close to three. Ooh, right up with the kick. But he's not done now. And he makes it to the ropes. I knew he could. Riddle not playing games anymore. Measuring him up. Riddle has him up. I think the champ's got it. Whenever tag team is on the docket, the mayhem multiplies. Here's the proof. Here are your winners, and still, Raw Tag Team Champions, The Viper, Randy Orton, and Riddle R.K. Bro! What an impressive performance and victory surviving against every other superstar in this match. Against all of the odds, it's honestly a miracle. I'm not so sure about a miracle, but definitely a big win here in this elimination match.